Did you call bank? I call game. What is up, Pack Nation? It's Pack here, and the question today is who is the best? Who are the five best players in the NBA according to NBA 2K19? We've already received a couple of players ratings for NBA 2K19, but there's some players that are missing that we don't have the ratings for yet. So the question is, who will be the top five rated players for the game? I'm going to give you my opinion. Let's get right into it. At number five, it is totally a tie with four different players, okay? We have already received the ratings for Kawhi Leonard, Anthony Davis, and Giannis Antetokounmpo all are a 94 overall I think they will all be tied for fifth best player however there's someone I'm adding on to that list and that is former MVP Russell Westbrook I think he will also be a 94 overall for a couple reasons first he has been 92 through 94 overall rated for NBA 2K18 all season. He's had back-to-back -back seasons with a triple-double, and just eye test-wise, this dude is one of the most dominant players in the league. And he didn't have the best team last season. Yes, he had Paul George and Steven Adams, but Carmelo was struggling last season, and the rest of his team, like everyone else on that team, is just cheeks. Russell Westbrook's rating could be higher or lower, but I think 94 is where it's going to be. Who is fourth? That is Steph Curry, 95 overall, I believe. They have not confirmed this player's rating yet, but I think it's going to be a 95 overall. So last 2K, he was a 94 through 96 overall the entire season. And if anyone thinks that he is way too high in this list, you're out of your mind. He had his second best season ever, statistically, last season. He won the championship. He's easily one of the best scorers in the league. And just to add, he is the best three-point shooter of all time. He may not be the most athletic player like Russell Westbrook or the most ridiculous like Anthony Davis or even the best defender like Kawhi, but none of them are as good as a shooter or a three-time NBA champion. That's just how it works. At number three, it is James Harden. So I also predicted this rating for a 96 overall. I was going to tie James Harden with Curry at 95 overall. And even though that still might be the best decision, I'm keeping him at 96 because I realized, wait, this dude is MVP this season. If I was personally doing ratings, I'd put this dude at a 95, but he is too good and he had too good of a season to have it any lower than 96. He helped CP3 get to his first conference finals and they were just a couple made threes away to making their first NBA finals against the best team in NBA history, just to add. People say Harden chokes. I say he just has a lot to go up against and he almost beat them. 96 overall is pretty good for him. The second best player in NBA 2K19 is Kevin Durant, who is a 97 overall, I believe that is the rating they will give him. No, Kevin Durant will not have the same rating as LeBron James. I'm not saying it's impossible, it's just super unlikely. But the Snake is easily the second best player in the NBA, a two-time NBA champion. Oh man, that hurts and two times final MVP. He at least deserves to have this 97 overall rating. So that means who's number one? It is Andre Ingram at 98 overall. I'm kidding. It is LeBron James at 98 overall. This is an official rating released by 2K. Of course he is, he is King James right now. Even though he had a 97 overall last 2K, I think because they're giving players higher ratings and because KD will probably be a 97, they wanted to give him a 98. Plus he's easily gonna be the best player on his team. So his rating will probably be going up. That is it for this list. Do you guys agree with me? Leave it in the comments below. And if you like my channel, give it a sub and I'll see you guys next time. Did you call back?